hello everyone uh today i would like to uh, show uh to you uh, the lesson with my uh tutor one more tutor uh this is the ceo of uh, online school uh, lingua flair and uh, now we are going to talk about uh, the uh, the role of the articles right uh, mm -hmm. yeah articles. and uh, yeah let, let, let's get started Mm -hmm. Okay, so uh, here, can you see the rule, right? First, you have the rule, and then after the rule, you have some exercises to train. So the articles, yeah, there or no article? Just so give, can you tell me? Just give mm -hmm. me a second, I'll share with, the, with this one, right? Nope, it's another one. Mm -hmm. yep. This one. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So the article air is there, no article. So can you tell me air, when can you use this article and when do you need to use it? Um, uh, you know, I don't know any uh, solid knowledge about all of these articles. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, I revised these uh, uh, rules beforehand, uh, just before this lesson. I guess it's like uh, when we mention uh, something uh, and the first time mm -hmm. uh, about general things, no? Yes, if it's a noun, if it's a singular noun. Mm -hmm. no, for example, a chair, a book, yes? And when you're mentioning this for the first time, so you use a. The difference between a and n? Yeah, I know, you know right? Uh, yeah. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Then uh, when you are speaking about jobs or professions, so with jobs, you always use a, a teacher, an engineer, a doctor. Mm -hmm. Okay, I got it. And then uh, if you want to exclaim something, what a beautiful day, what a nice weather. So with the exclamation, what, you always use a as well. Mm -hmm. Okay. And uh, in expressions of frequency, it means how often do you do something? For example, I go to the gym once a month. Mm -hmm. I travel abroad once a year. Mm -hmm. It's the expressions of frequency. Uh, you can uh, read it by yourself about A and N. Mm -hmm. Here, right? Yeah. So all these points. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's move on to the mm -hmm. next. Yeah, then it's there. So when do you use there? Uh, the, we use the uh, article there when we talk about the, the specific uh, subject uh, mm -hmm. or like a subject when we mentioned before. Uh, mm -hmm. Like, uh, you know, I adopted a dog. Mm -hmm. Uh, you know the name of the dog, like uh, mm -hmm. Drujok. It's my dog. Yeah, no, so it's the yeah. You, so you know exactly what dog are you talking about? <laughs> mm -hmm. okay. And uh, like a specific place, uh, the Earth, something like that. Uh, not, not specific, like uh, just only one. Um, you know, example. Mm, one. Uh, yeah, when there is something one. Mm -hmm. and uh, oh. like uh, the best this is uh, mm -hmm. only one thing so the best can be and that's it mm -hmm. oh yeah it's like right you are so the first one it's when you're talking about something that you already know what is it then when you uh, speak about something that is just one in the universe for example the internet mm -hmm. so it's one the sun the moon the president, because he is uh, the only one in the country, mm -hmm. the capital. Yes, then uh, superlatives. The best, it was superlative. So the best, mm -hmm. the worst, the most beautiful, mm -hmm. and so on. And there are some places in the town. It's like, uh, 
You always do it. Like you go to the theater, go to the gym, go to the cinema. I didn't understand the second point. Uh, one is clear what you are referring to. Give me examples. It's, it's for example, can you close the window, please? So you know exactly what window you mm -hmm. need to close. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Can you give me the pen, please? Mm -hmm. So it's exactly this one that you are having right there. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. And then the situation when there is no article. This one. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> well, it's you know. about the first example. Women usually talk more than men. It's when you're talking something in general and with plural nouns. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, About plural. Yeah. I know. So these women and this man, they are not some specific women and men. They are just men and women in general. Mm -hmm. But if you want to say about specific women, you can say the women usually talk more about the men. But it means you are talking about some women and men that you know. It will be like a man with R with the letters A, right? Woman. No, and now we're man. talking about plural. Oh, mm -hmm. okay. Here, women and men, there it's like plural nouns. Mm -hmm. Okay. No, then the second example, love is more important than money. Yes, so it's the same, it's just in general. In general, love, in general, money. Mm -hmm. Okay. <clears throat> so you can look uh, at the first point of the rule when we are speaking in general, so this one. And compare, I love flowers and I love the flowers in my garden. Mm -hmm. These are just two different situations. Flowers yeah, yeah, yeah. And, so this yeah, one, well, you got it, yeah? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Then uh, with some nouns, you can use it without the, for example, go home. Yes, there is no article. Mm -hmm. I am at work. No article as well. I go to school every day. Mm -hmm. so, no, if we talk just... about if we talk about the institution, right? If we talk about the building, it will be like a change, right? No, it's not like exactly buildings. It's just uh, after some prepositions, usually we don't use it. With some nouns after prepositions, for example, at preposition to and from. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. So after these prepositions with the nouns, you don't use uh, the article. Mm -hmm. Okay. Then number three, it's before meals. For example, I have breakfast, I have lunch, I have dinner. You don't use the uh, preposition. Days of the weeks, on Monday, on Tuesday, and so on. And months. For oh, example, I, I go abroad uh, in January. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. And uh, with the words next and last, for example, next Monday, I'm flying to Moscow. Okay, okay. No, it's, it's again, it's day of the week. Mm -hmm. So with the days mm -hmm. of the week, you don't use anything. Mm -hmm. Then uh, you have some uh, exercises to train yourself after the rule. About this one? Yep. So let's try to do letter A. Okay. Mm. Okay, so call the correct answer. I love weddings. Uh, they are weddings. I love this is a weddings like a special occasion, right? It's like weddings in general. Mm -hmm. Okay. So plural noun and in general. You just in general like weddings. Mm -hmm. Okay. Just is just is a mm, it's is nurse a nurse or... i guess is a nurse right yeah why because so we mentioned about the first time it, no because it's a job mm -hmm. it's a profession nurse yeah, you can go up to the rule. So it's the 
the second point when you say that something is or what somebody does so it's about profession mm -hmm. okay um a hospital the hospital is far from her uh Mm -hmm. Just give me in yours in a hospital, yeah, and I try to. Rem <laughs> I remember where it's located. It's like, a, I guess uh, with with there, right? No. Yes, it's with there, and why it's with there? With the building. Uh, you have the first sentence. So she's a nurse in a hospital. So you have already mentioned. Okay, 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 okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. What a horrible day. What a horrible. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's an exclamation, right? Yeah, a. it's exclamation. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. One point for me. <laughs> <laughs> we will have to have our picnic. In the car, in a car. I guess in the car, because it's specifically. It's specific car, yes, because you know what car it will be, mm -hmm. like your car. Okay. Now it's much better. <laughs> mm -hmm. My wife likes love stories. Uh, without preposition, because I guess uh, uh, this is a you know like a general information, usual, mm -hmm. right? Yep, like general. Mm -hmm. But I prefer mm, the war, I, I guess, movies, because uh, specific, no? Uh, war movies and love stories, these are just genres of movies. And without, I prefer yes. war. Okay. No, basically, like, it depends on the situation. You can say I prefer what in this exact case. You can say I prefer war movies because it's in general. But if you wanted to say I prefer the war movies by I don't know and the name of some director, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I get then it. it will be the war movies because it's some specific war movies. Uh, we go to the theater. Uh, but because uh, this is a building, this is a mm -hmm. this you know yeah. places in that city. Uh, yeah, about once a month. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'm having dinner without, without because okay. because this is a, <laughs> because this is dinner <laughs> with some yeah, friends. Because it's meal. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because uh, with some friends next Friday mm -hmm. because it's mm -hmm. Friday and day of the week. Okay. My boyfriend is uh, a chief. Yeah, a chief? It's a chef. A chef. Is a, a chef. Uh, because it's professional. Mm -hmm. I think he's, a, he's the best cook in the world. The best because this is a, how to say, superlative form, superlative right? Superlative form, yeah, of the mm -hmm. object. I'm not sure if I close the windows the windows because i guess uh, uh, they uh, talk about the specific place the specific mm -hmm. uh, um, you know things in the building in the room mm -hmm. before i left i left the home no, no usually usually you say i leave home i go home so without any preposition it's like a, a common phrase okay there, mm -hmm. there are some phrases like you always use it like this. I go home. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Home, go. So you, you don't put any prepositions. Mm -hmm. In general, I like dogs. But I don't like uh, the dogs that live next door to me. Mm -hmm. Yeah. First of all, without, then with the. Yeah, the I go to mm -hmm. the school. I go to school. Without the to school, okay. It's the same rule as I go mm. home, mm -hmm. go to school mm -hmm. every day. Uh, every day last week. Mm -hmm. Yeah. With, yeah. I think 
I think happiness more important is more important than uh, success. It's like mm -hmm. a love, and uh, it's a uh, like a yeah. They, this no, is... these are common things. Yes. Yeah. In general. Mm -hmm. Okay. Then uh, letter B. Here yeah. you need to put articles or no articles by yourself. Uh, we are lost. Let's stop and buy. And buy a map with A. No, this one, the first one you have as an example. Ah, yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Uh, the one, the first one. Uh, how often do you go to, to gym? Like a, like a home, like a school, right? No, these are places in the city. Go to the gym, go to the cinema, go to the theater. Okay. <laughs> to the gym. Okay. About three times a week, but I never mm -hmm. go on Fridays. Mm -hmm. okay. okay. What time does... Does, uh, does the train... Specific yeah, train. Yeah, because it's specific train. Uh, in 10 minutes, can you give me... Uh, give me a ride to the station. A ride to the station. Give me a ride. It's like a fixed phrase. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're always like a location. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What is the beautiful? What What is the beautiful this? You don't need to put the verb. Is you need to put the article. What a beautiful. A. What a beautiful dress. Yeah. What a beautiful. Okay. Thanks. I bought in on. I bought it on. A sale last month. Mm -hmm. Yep. I don't know why, but just <laughs> subconsciously. I... Yeah, like with the articles, it's often like this. Sometimes you don't know why you use it, but it's like you often use it this way. Okay. It's like the the some feelings. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What is the most? What is the most interesting what is the most yes <laughs> the most because it's a yeah. Point. yeah 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 mm -hmm. probably the museum because it's mm -hmm. the place in the town in the town and and it's a certain museum that he's talking about it, yeah it is uh, the oldest building in town mm -hmm. okay what should we do next weekend without preposition Mm -hmm. Without articles or a preposition, it no, is articles. Well, without article. Without article. Preposition. Okay. It's like in yeah, on yeah. it. Mm -hmm. uh, let's uh, invite some friends for lunch. For lunch, yes, because it's a meal. We could eat outside in in the yard. Mm -hmm. Do you like a dogs? No, it's plural noun. Dogs air, it's impossible. Do you air, like dogs? You... Do you like yeah. dogs? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Not really. I prefer I prefer cats mm -hmm. without. Okay. I think they are the best pets. The best. The best because it's related, yeah. Yeah. Is your mom uh, uh, a housewife? Mm -hmm. Why okay. is a housewife? Because it's a, like a job, like a professional. It's professional. Okay. Now she is a teacher. She is a teacher, professional. She's, uh, she's always um, tired. Uh, she's always uh, tired when she gets home from a work. From mm -hmm. work. From work, yeah, because it's like collocation. You always say, come home from Oh, work. yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. okay have you ever had a problem mm -hmm. in your relationship had it's a problem a have a problem why we because have it, because it's some problem just some problem that you are talking for the first time okay because i it, for me it's just a collocation have a problem <laughs> have a problem problem it's a singular noun okay and you are talking for the first time about this mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. yes but we got over 
Yes, but we got over the problem because we mentioned, right? This is a dialogue. Yes, because now it's a specific problem that he's talking yeah. about. And we got married last year because this is a time like a year days mm -hmm. okay when is when is the meeting it's like a specific meeting right mm -hmm. there is a change of the date right yeah they've changed the day date because you know, it's a specific, specific date, date. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. it is next tuesday now uh uh okay this is uh, only a little part of our uh lessons uh, thank you for giving me uh, mm, how to say in english mm, access yeah uh, for recorded this video and mm -hmm. share with my audience oh uh, thank you <laughs> welcome come <Yeah>. again <laughs> okay uh goodbye mm -hmm. bye bye